I was just telling the guys, recreating that story that you told when you go in that Monday and, and uh, Peel was either playing Madden or watching football or just somehow heard DeBrickishaw Ferguson's name and how it it was such a light bulb there. Like, you know, I, I remember DeBrickishaw Ferguson at, like, Virginia. Like, I, I'm so accustomed to those names, but here's, you know, Jordan Peel, who's not a sports fan, and he's going, wait a minute. And then yeah. you're a sports fan, so you probably never – looked at this and listened to this and went, oh, there's nothing. Wait, that's funny? That's, but, that's a football name. I'm like, what are we talking about here? It's a, I, I think I even said to Jordan, I, when he said, man, how is there a dude named DeBrickashaw Ferguson? <laughs> and I said, I said, wait a minute, first of all. I said, that's in the pros, Jordan. We haven't even touched the tip of the iceberg when you get to college. The names. The na- and, and the funny thing is, to his, t- to his credit and to his talent, he didn't even do any research when he wrote those, the rest of those names. He just made them up. <laughs> the blueprint was to Brickshaw Ferguson. I'm like, okay, guess if you're going to use a blueprint, that would be the one. Either that, you know, or a Barkevius Mingo. I mean, all he needed was to hear those two names, and he was off to the races. Man. I got one for you. Uh, yeah. This guy plays at Kentucky. Pauly? Yeah, running back Cavassier Smoke. <laughs> yeah. Smoke. Yeah. Yeah. his last name is smoke amazing well i'm okay with smoke curvassier curvassier <laughs> as in that he must have come out of the womb a very sophisticated looking baby curvassier. for them to call him curvassier you know what i mean and he's got a brother hennessy Oh my! Of course. No, he does. no he doesn't. I, I was joking about that. But. <laughs> oh, I believe you, one hundred percent. When I was a kid, the big thing was um, that there were there in my neighborhood there were two kids named. I'm going to go the exact opposite direction on this. There were two kids named A and B Johnson. They were twins, <laughs> and their names were A and B. And I'm like, you can't do that to a child. <laughs> I, I I had some rough names that I grew up with, and that, that I can't even say them on the show. Oh, jeez. <laughs> it, it's off color, and I gotcha. uh, yes, but you know, you grow up, and you, that's just the person's name. You don't even think twice about it, and then somebody goes, "Wait, you went to school with somebody named that?" Wait. Right, right, Ex- exactly, right. And I know is it, you just kind of think to yourself, "Oh, that's just you know, that's uh, that's uh, Giorgio, or Giorgio, not not the not the craziest name." <laughs> I went to school. I went to high school. Now here's another one. I went to high school um, with a gentleman by the name of Ignacio Hawthorne. <laughs> great name. I thought that was a great name because it sounded like he should have been in an old Dickens novel. <laughs> Ignacio Hawthorne. <laughs> like, like, but you just call him Iggy, or do you- Iggy? Yeah, Iggy. It's which is like one to me one of the best nicknames ever. You know, it's like also a good Detroit nickname because Iggy pops from Detroit. Oh, that's right. And I have to put, I have to put in I have to talk about at least two to three uh, people who are from Detroit on every interview. And, uh, yeah. Did you get in everybody you needed to get in? I think I got everybody in. Oh, I just have to say Barry Sanders. I just have to say it <laughs> randomly every time. 